At the radiology department in the Kolebu Teaching Hospital in Accra, hundreds of chest x-rays, CT scans and MRI images are analyzed every day. Officials say the manual process is very tedious, especially in clinics where there are inadequate professionals. For the longest time, some of the regions in Ghana was maybe one radiologist to the entire region. Yeah. So imagine if you have, call it, 50 chest films to review, and each one even takes three minutes to review. That's a lot of time. It eats up a big chunk of your day. To help improve the turnaround time, Darlington Akogo is piloting an AI system with radiologists here. As an AI engineer, he applies technology to provide solutions that boost productivity in sectors such as agriculture and health. We've built a system that allows for medical image interpretation, or at least it assists with that. So with the AI system, basically you can drop in a medical image in this case, chest x-ray. You drop it in, our AI system will analyze it and then pinpoint potential abnormalities, abnormalities, potential diseases, potential conditions, and let you know about it. AI is not yet widely used in Ghana. While it's used in countries like Nigeria, South Africa, and Kenya, continues to grow. While AI can help radiologists in Ghana improve their productivity, Lawmakers in Ghana want legislation to be passed to control the overall use of artificial intelligence in the country. They believe it has some risk and could increase inequality in other sectors of the economy. There are concerns about job losses to AI. About 100 million young people in Africa won't be able to find jobs by 2030, according to the African Development Bank. Tech experts believe AI could provide new job opportunities to make up for the lost jobs. They also highlight the need for African governments to invest more in tech infrastructure and energy supply. If we're aiming to have this adopted and run all the time, we need to have steady power power supply. Next to it, it runs off the internet. Internet is even sportier than electricity, second challenge. Dalentin Akogo agrees. He believes AI has the potential to change the face of healthcare delivery in Ghana with the required attention and investment, Nabil Ahmed Rufai, CGTN, Accra, Ghana.